Hi guys, this is me, Fania. Hello. Hello. Hey guys, this is me, Fan, and today I'm going to show you how to install Windows XP Professional 64 bit. So, first off, what you want to do is have um, VM VirtualBox installed, the latest version maybe, and you want to click on New. And you want to call this uh, Windows XP Professional X64. The folder, just keep it as um, the um, save folder. ISO image, there's, there'll be an ISO image in the description. Um, I'm just going to skip unattended installs, installation. Next, um, you should put this to like 512 born CPU but I uh, usually I put it at, I put it out to um four um four um four four gigabytes of RAM and six cores of um CPU. Just keep it as ten gigabytes. And then now you should go into settings Set um, system. Make sure this is on. Uh, go to display. Uh, enable 3D acceleration. Put that all the way up. Um, keep everything else in that. And press start. Come up with this window setup. You don't click and don't like press any keys. Just let it do its own thing. Don't click any keys. Like don't press any keys. Sorry for shouting, uh, kids. <laughs> kids, uh, there's no manual for them. Right. Um, just press enter. FA to agree. Um, enter. Install on there. Uh, format the partition using the NTFS. Just keep it as that. Now it's going to um, install everything on here. We're going to press enter to start the computer. Don't click anything, don't press anything. Because it's already been uh, put on the hard drive, so there's no point. We'll say this probably. Windows XP X X64 edition. It's professional. Windows XP professional. As you can see from here. Well, not that. <laughs> I just let the setup do its thing. <laughs> What's good about um, 64-bit Windows XP is that guest editions will um, install faster, but you can't get Firefox. I've tried it that y last night and it did not work. I'm sorry, guys. Try to get Firefox 52.90 didn't work. Um, for me, I would just put this, uh, you can, if you can put, you can put United States if you want to, but I'm going to put mine as United Kingdom, because you know I'm a Brit. I'm proud of it. United Kingdom. Um, change that, obviously, because uh, I don't like, I don't like United States keyboard layout. It would just keep it like that. Uh, I'm just going to put my name. 
<laughs> Product key. Now, I have been searching all over the internet for this. Uh, Product key is VCF QD V9F X9 46W VH K3 K3 CD4 4J3 Maybe. Hopefully that works. Yep, it will work. Uh, you can put a password if you want to, but I'm going to, obviously. <laughs> I'm too much of a fat, fast typer. That's why I always screw up when typing. I'm not really used to it. Right, press next. Whoops. <laughs> I'm gonna press every key carefully. <laughs> right, I press next. Uh, since I'm not from there, London. I just want to finish up. Uh, put it as typical settings. We're group. Yeah. Let it finish up. It won't take 17 minutes. It take like less. Restart now. <laughs> Once done, don't press any key. Don't press any key here. Now it should uh, actually be the thing now. Right, press next. Should just log in straight away. Which is, I have a password on mine, which I'm going to put in right now. Now what you can do is you can um shut up. Um you can put in the uh, guest editions. Oh you should supposed to go in by yourself. I'm gonna need it. <laughs> oh well. Uh yes. Yeah. 
Yes. But we also have everything continue on here. Continue on here. to restore view there we go I'm going to change that because it's very stretchy Yeah, you can't get a guest edition. You can't get Firefox on here. Sorry, guys. But yeah, that's how you get Windows XP Professional 64-bit. Thank you all for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.